Giant clams, the little-known leviathans of the marine world, are more than just an underwater anomaly. They are intricately woven into the tapestry of marine biodiversity, contributing to the ecological balance and beauty of coral reefs. These bivalves are not only remarkable for their size, but also for their role in the ecosystem, providing shelter and sustenance to a variety of marine life. Giant clams are considered rare due to several intrinsic and extrinsic factors. Biologically, they have a low fecundity rate, which means they do not reproduce quickly or in large numbers. Environmentally, their preferred reef habitats are under threat from climate change, pollution and human interference, further diminishing their numbers. Their distribution is predominantly in the warm waters of the Indo-Pacific region, which adds a geographical limitation to their availability. Conservation status reports from various marine research organizations highlight that some species of giant clams are now listed as endangered. Giant clams possess several unique physical and biological traits that distinguish them from other marine organisms. They are the largest living bivalve mollusks, with some species capable of growing more than four feet in length and weighing over 500 pounds. Their most fascinating biological characteristic is their symbiotic relationship with photosynthetic algae, known as zooxanthellae. These algae reside in the clam's tissues, giving them their vibrant colors while providing nutrients through photosynthesis, which in turn supports the clam's slow growth and survival. Ah. The radiant colors of giant clams are not just for show, they are a byproduct of their symbiotic relationships with algae. These colors can range from bright blues and greens to stunning purples and golds, depending on the species and environmental factors. Giant clams grow at a painstakingly slow pace, often taking several decades to reach their full size. This slow growth rate is partially due to their reliance on the efficient but slow process of photosynthesis for nutrient acquisition. Their long lifespan, which can extend to over 100 years, is testament to their slow-paced existence. The rarity and striking appearance of giant clams make them highly sought after in various markets. In the aquarium trade, they are prized for their beauty and the exotic allure they add to marine tanks. In some cultures, their meat and shells are considered delicacies and symbols of status and wealth, respectively. This high demand, coupled with their limited supply, drives up their market value significantly, making them one of the most expensive marine organisms. The economic implications of this are vast, influencing both local and international marine trade policies. Harvesting giant clams is no small feat and involves various traditional and modern techniques. Traditional methods often include free diving, where divers harvest clams by hand, a practice that is both skill-intensive and risky. Modern methods might involve scuba gear or even robotic assistance to reach deeper waters where these clams reside. Each method has its own set of challenges, primarily relating to the depth at which these clams are found and the potential dangers of underwater harvesting such as decompression sickness and encounters with other marine life. The harvesting and trade of giant clams are regulated by various international and local laws to prevent overexploitation. Sites, Convention on International Trade in Endangered Species of Wild Fauna and Flora, includes several species of giant clams in its appendices, which regulate their trade. Nationally, countries within the clams' natural range have enacted specific laws that govern their harvest, trade and conservation. These regulations are crucial in balancing the needs of local communities with the imperatives of conservation. Conservation efforts for giant clams are multifaceted, involving protected areas, breeding programs, and international cooperation. Marine protected areas, or MPAs, provide a sanctuary for these clams, allowing them to grow and reproduce away from the pressures of harvesting. Breeding and restocking programs, often run by marine research institutes, aim to replenish natural populations and maintain genetic diversity. International collaborations also play a critical role in sharing research, resources, and best practices for the conservation of these marine giants.
Aquaculture has emerged as a vital tool in the conservation and sustainable management of giant clams. By cultivating clams in controlled environments, researchers and conservationists can increase their numbers without putting additional pressure on wild populations. These aquaculture initiatives not only supply the ornamental and culinary markets, but also contribute to reef rehabilitation projects, where cultured clams are introduced to degraded areas to help restore ecosystem functions. Giant clams play a significant ecological role in their habitats. They are, essentially, bioengineers of the reef ecosystems, contributing to the structural complexity that supports diverse marine life. Their ability to cycle nutrients and enhance water clarity also makes them invaluable to the health of coral reefs. However, their removal from these ecosystems, whether through legal or illegal means, can have detrimental effects on reef health and biodiversity, highlighting the need for stringent conservation measures. While aquaculture is a promising conservation tool, it comes with its own set of challenges. One of the primary issues is the simulation of natural conditions, which is crucial for the survival and growth of cultured clams. This includes replicating light conditions, water quality, and temperature, which can be both technologically demanding and costly. Additionally, disease management in high-density cultivation environments poses a significant risk, requiring ongoing research and innovation in aquatic veterinary sciences. The future of giant clams hinges on the effectiveness of current conservation efforts and the evolution of aquaculture technologies. With advances in marine biology and environmental engineering, there is potential to enhance both the conservation outcomes and the commercial viability of giant clams. Predictive modeling and genetic research could also lead to breakthroughs in understanding and managing their populations more effectively ensuring that these majestic creatures continue to thrive in their natural habitats. The journey of understanding and conserving giant clams is a testament to the complexity and interconnectivity of marine life. These underwater giants are not merely inhabitants of the ocean, but are pivotal in maintaining the ecological equilibrium of marine ecosystems. It is imperative that we continue to support and advance conservation efforts and sustainable practices to ensure that future generations can also marvel at the beauty and ecological importance of giant clams. Our actions today will determine the legacy we leave beneath the waves.